Okay, J.S., you have a tremendous new announcement to make, I hear. Uh, besides the fact that you're making the best games at the best prices, tell me about this announcement here at Ball Expo. Yes, so we recently signed up a product uh, cooperation or a product development with uh, Brunswick Bowling, uh, where we've collaborated to create this new product called as Spark to create interactivity and an enhanced engaging and uh, phenomenal experience for the bowlers. Uh, we have come up with licenses of Rovio Angry Birds that go onto the bowling lanes to add a game on top of game. So there are two la uh, layers to this product right now. One is uh, what we call as the spark experience where you get to uh, put it on any uh, bowling alley, it doesn't matter who the manufacturer of the bowling lanes is. Uh, Both synthetic and wood? Yes, uh, because it's projection, so it doesn't matter. It could be projected onto wood, synthetic, any surface that can take projection. Uh, the, the Spark experience itself has about 15 different interactive uh, uh, animations that can go onto the bowling lanes and create a very engaging and a very wow experience. Uh, whereas the game side of it, we've come up with five new games, one of which is Angry Birds, which we are highly excited about. And yeah. we've shown it to Rovio and they're quite excited. They, uh, they, they, they think that it, it, they could add more stuff to this than what we already have. And then there is other lineup for uh, new licenses that we are talking about. Uh, we're very excited because it's uh, a great partnership with the company, Brunswick, which is a 125-year-old company, sure. been the best in the business for such a long period of time. They are in six continents, have a, such a well-established sales and distribution channel. And we had a phenomenal uh, technology that we could leverage with uh, uh, partnership uh, with Brunswick. So we are very, very excited about this and we are uh, looking at taking this to the next level. We've we just, uh, day before yesterday, we did our product launch at the Red Rock Casino here in Vegas. It was a private closed door event in their VIP area uh, where we, uh, where the capacity was about 150 people, but 350 people turned up at the launch uh, site and everybody's phenomenally excited. I mean, we've already sold about 200 units prior to the launch. So, I mean, that shows that people are, are looking to upgrade to the locations. Are, are people doing their whole centers with this or just some of the lanes and then add on as you go? So there is a mix of uh, uh, both types. Uh, some people are looking at adding this to their VIP area only to add that enhanced experience to their VIP guests. Uh, whereas uh, like a casino location like Red Rock, which has a phenomenal budget, they would probably look at doing it all, all over their uh, 70 lanes uh, or even at across four locations so that would itself be about 300 bowling lanes with one that's, single customer that's incredible yes does, <coughs> excuse me does it uh, <laughs> from regulation bowling is it faster slower or exactly the same time uh, it is exactly the same time uh, and uh, the good thing about this is that uh, some people who do not know the traditional bowling game who almost always ended up putting their balls in the gutter. Uh, now don't need to worry because uh, there is a game on top of game. So, I mean, you will score no matter whether you hit the pins or not. So you can still be in the game, whether you know the traditional bowling. I know more than half the people do not even know how the scoring works in a traditional bowling game, right? Like most people who go today are all casual bowlers to a bowling center for entertainment. So adding this additional level of uh, entertainment and engagement on on a game over game with great licenses like Rovio, uh, Angry Birds is, I think, a phenomenal experience. Yeah. Do the uh, <clears throat> the skill shots do they they move and change and be very difficult to make, or uh, how no. does that work? Uh, so it uh, so since it is a software driven product development roadmap. You could have it in various forms. It could be something that is moving, or it could be constant, so, the, so that you know you aim straight. Uh, so it could be a mix and match of all sorts of things. Whether you want people to bowl straight, then you could have all the all the objects lined up in a straight line, or it could be just randomly appearing anywhere. So it could be a mix and match of everything. Do you know how I learned how to score bowling? It was very easy for me because I never got a strike. I never got a spare. So every time a pin went down, it counted as one. <laughs> yeah, so uh, Anoop and I, uh, Anoop is good at bowling and I really don't do well. So, but there was this one game where 
I could score more than him because of the game in game that allowed me to score points on the sides and he, he, he was aiming at the pins so he was good at that and he was getting the pins right but when I got the points or the other objects that were on the lanes with the, yeah I beat him and what happened? Yeah, it was exciting because I never beat him in the past and then when this new game comes up I get to beat him so that's something now I'm going to go again and again to bowl because I know now that even though I can't bowl the traditional bowling in a bowling lane I can still do something better in this new so what version to Anu? Did he quit yeah. bowling? No, he's going to now practice hard to get oh, better at the so new version practice. of bowling. Yes. Got it. Yeah. So this works all over. <laughs> this is great. Yes. All right. Thank you. Thank you so I, much. I want Mike. you to keep just keep inventing more new software and more new games for us so yes. we can all make more money. Thank you. Thank you very much for your support.